this is Anshul Puri. Uh, I'm a proud year homemaker and uh, I've been uh, a patient here at Isha Hospital since more than seven years, I guess. So uh, I had very painful periods and not only painful periods, I suffered from many digestive issues also. And the pain was such that I cannot explain. I mean, you cannot even sit straight, that kind of pain I used to experience. So this is the first hospital. These are the first doctors who could diagnose and treat my pain. And today I'm symptom free. I'm happy to say that. I'm totally symptom free. And I would like to continue my treatment here. Uh, forever. Yeah, I have been to a lot of gynecs earlier. In fact, some of them I even suggested whether I had endometriosis or not. You know, today in Wikipedia you can search for symptoms and just ask suggest. the doctor. Yes, suggest the doctor. But they were very confident that I did not have it. But <laughs> yeah. from my first visit itself, Dr. Shilpi Shukla diagnosed it with confirmation that I had stage 4 endometriosis. And, uh, uh, before that you were operated also for uh, yeah. pain and it was something else? Yes, so some, some, one of the doctors suggested it was appendix which had inflamed and I got an operation for that and got my appendix removed also which now I think was useless. Okay, uh, where, you, where you suggest, like they were suggesting that the pregnancy will relieve your pain? Yeah. So the, the symptoms had started much before my marriage. Yes, right from my puberty I had the symptoms. So whenever I went to a guy now, they always recommended that and suggested that please wait. When you get married and conceive, you your symptoms will fade away. <laughs> so that is the answer I used to get. And what happened actually? It never went away. In fact, the condition deteriorated and you know, I, it was very difficult for to do my daily tasks on, on those days when my periods used to be there. So, I mean ultimately because of extreme pain I had to come and visit okay. Dr. Shilpesh. Yeah. Were you given uh, uh, like options that these are the options which you have and you had to choose or this was the option which was given there? Here, yes. They, before any treatment, they were very, uh, all the treatment protocols and the uh, procedures were explained, my um, options were given to me and I had to choose the one which I found that is the best for me. Okay. So was stage 4 endometriosis diagnosed pre-operatively or, or were you told that now it is since in, during surgery they could identify? No, it was diagnosed pre-operatively. Pre -operatively. Yes. Okay. Were you uh, told that you know it is also affecting intestines and other other yeah, organs also. Uh, that that was also explained. It, it was explained. So how is your perioperative experience of the surgery itself and your stay in the hospital? Very good. I mean, I'm very satisfied. That's what. Okay. Yeah. Uh, when was it painful your surgery? No, not at all. <laughs> was in your, fact, I was relieved uh, that. They're doing something for my problem. Yeah. Okay. Was it uh, painful after surgery? Not at all. Not at all. So that part is actually sort of it was pain free. Pain free. Which most yeah. of the people are afraid. Of. Yeah. See why people are not going for the surgery? You are afraid about perioperative pain. Yeah. No, not at all. Okay. Anything else uh, has been done which was? Yeah. Uh, uh, I. Uh, you know, as per one of the options for treatment, I mean, for so that it does not relapse, they asked me to uh, use a intrauterine uh, device. device, which is known as Mirena. And uh, what can, I can tell you, like, I have been on uh, some oral capsules also earlier, but what Mirena has done to me, I mean, the kind of effect that it has, I have never found it any other kind of treatment. So right now, whatever symptomless you feeling are. I have, yeah, that is totally because of me. Plus the operation, oh, operation, yeah. operation. but the yeah post-operative treatment was the best using Mirena. So what would you recommend to the other patients who other are probably patients. suffering from same disease? Yeah, firstly, you know, <laughs> you need to shed your inhibitions and come. 
so Come that on, yeah. because people and the doctors, the uh, team here, I guess are very knowledgeable and uh, their expertise, you know, shows in the way they treat and handle their patients. The confidence is there <laughs> because they never lose their temper. I've seen they are always very cool and they explain everything very fine. First thing you have to do is you have to come and explain yourself. Then only that's the first step to diagnose. So period has to be pain free. You cannot yeah. accept it that okay, period is a period and it has to be pain. Yes, that's not natural. Natural. That's not natural. Okay. And then uh, uh, the operative uh, treatment is really helpful. Yes, very helpful. The kind of protocol they suggest are very helpful to manage your pain. Thank you. Yeah, thank you.